Hey guys, welcome back to um, <clears throat> Lord of the Rings uh, gameplay on my Warden. Now, I don't know if any of you guys, heard, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys heard that basically Turbine, uh, I think, I think the person, I don't know 100% all the information, but it seems like Turbine has been either let go by Warner Brothers, or have been um, disbanded, or not disbanded, but they were let go by Warner Brothers and they don't own the name Turbine, apparently. That's just what I'm getting, um, you know. But they apparently made a new uh, development um, crew, and they call, I think, Standstone Gaming. And the people that worked on Lotro started playing, I mean, started working for that uh, company. And they are also now being published. I, whoa, why does this seem very soft? Like, I feel like I'm not getting... No, there we go. I just have to jump up and down. But um, they are also being uh, hosted by a company, called, I think, called Day Daybreak, which uh, my friend told me is a Russian... Russian... Um, Russian company, I don't know. But while we're doing quests, let me see. This is we must not stand idle. There's much to be done. Repeatable, so I'm not. So I'm actually supposed to collect sets of horseshoe. And it's supposed to be around here. There we go. But yeah, so basically, it's either a good or bad thing that they left WB. It's good because the people that always were working with um, on Lotro and apparently this other game called DDO have now just. That seems like those are currently just their focus is uh, Lotro and uh, DDO, but now I don't know how where they're gonna get all their money from because I don't know how that works with them. So to me, it doesn't really look. It's 50/50. Like I said, um, it seems like they have their own uh, little group that works on just Lotro and DDO, but they have a new publishing company. So if you guys want to look up on who is their publisher, uh, I don't know, I think you'll see it when you log in the game, you'll see the logo change, it's no longer Turbine WB, it's a totally new logo, and a totally a new agree uh, agreement thing, so yeah. Um, so I don't know if it's gonna be the end of Lotro, if it is, it, it will be sad, because, well... I loved this game, yeah, past tense, loved, and of course I still love my hobbits, so it will, what will suck for me the most is probably that I will no longer be able to play my character. Like I said, there's no hobbits at all in any other games that I can think of that's like, you know, popular or semi-popular, you know? I don't know if there's gonna be a Lord of the Rings Online 2 in the future. But, yeah. And uh, I am currently mostly playing uh, um, Guild Wars 2 these days. A lot, like I said, a lot of people from the uh, I play with in Lotro are there. Like, a lot. Uh, well, not, I don't want to say a lot, but a lot of people that basically I have people to play with throughout the day. Um, mostly in the morning and nights. I'm usually not on in the afternoon because that's when I do I don't do any I don't do game stuff in the afternoon unless maybe it's a beta or whatever. So what am I gonna do here? Shoe Brenmon and Flight so I have to shoot three horses. So I yeah, that's about it. So hopefully if you guys that's what's going on with Lotro that I've noticed. What? Already in use. You can't do the. Oh, I have to. I can't move. Did you see that? That was not look like he was. Um, he would look like he was milking the horse. I guess I was too close. So I'm gonna go to the press. You. I was pressing the wrong key. See, it looks like he's milking. Milking the horse. Okay, we're gonna. I can't zoom out right. Yeah, no. So there we go, and we're gonna, I think this is the third one. Okay, and now that's done, I have to talk to Huta. 
Um, today's date is... I don't know what the date is today. Is it the 20-something? The 23rd or 22nd? I don't know. I think the 23rd. And, um, well, or this will be... It's either the 22nd or the 23rd, and I don't know if it's going to be published to the 22nd or the 23rd or... Yeah. But Saturday, I'm going to go, um, to a holiday, uh, get-together, um with my uh, parents and my sister and my sister's boyfriend and we're going over her house and I'm gonna be cooking fried rice and meatloaf to bring over there cuz I don't she I don't she doesn't want to cook so yeah so that's what's the plan is for the 24th and then, and for the 25th um, I'm probably gonna, oh, to 25th I'm going to my uncle's house and they're gonna have, as for, I don't know, a dinner or lunch or something, but it's, they're cooking everything, so thank god, I don't have to cook anything, and then, you know. Okay, I went here, and now where am I supposed to go? Oh, I'm supposed to go all the way south. So I hope you guys are having a good, um, Christmas. Um, I personally don't give a shit about it, um, I don't know, if the, the older you get, the, the less you give a shit about stuff, I guess, or it's just me, but to me, it's just Christmas is, um, it's nice, I like the decoration, I like the, all the merry, co the merriment, or whatever the Will fuck, the horse lords? I like the atmosphere, I like the, um, decorations, but after the 25th, it's like, guess what? The year, the other year is over. Uh, bye. So that's the reason why I don't really like it. But everything else, I like. Like I said, I like everything that builds up. You did very well. I did very well. Finished now. I need your help. Meet the riders three at Eralas. Okay, so I have to do this. Um, I actually still have to collect sheep. Gather wool. Gathering wool, that's the sheep. Meet grow near ransoms the ransomer's son. Okay, so that's way too far. So we're gonna do gather sheep first. And actually we're gonna do these two quests. These three quests. So the first thing we're gonna do is uh the vengeance one. Actually, you know what? We're gonna do this how we're gonna we're gonna make it all red that we're not working on it. We're gonna do the green one first. So that's what we're gonna go to next. So yeah. Anyways, but after the 25th, I usually take off the Christmas lights because I don't want to be reminded that guess what? It's uh, Christmas is over. But like I said, that's just me. So mostly this episode is um, about talking about uh, how Lotro, I mean Turbine, is no longer exist, or I guess I don't know what the fuck happened to them. And obviously Lotro is now controlled or owned or developed by a new um the new company so yeah so let me go on my horse and apparently some things are called different things are in the lotro store like it's not turbine points anymore it's called lotro points i don't know even the icon can you see the icon right here changed you look at your lotro store icon the coin is totally different it used to be the turbine icon, and no longer. So, you know, you can tell they've changed it. So I'm just going to actually get to this location in Eralas, and then this episode is over. So, thanks guys for watching, and I hope you guys have a good uh, Christmas or holiday or whatever you celebrate. And I will see you guys next time. And also, um, check out my video my video details for links to my other crap um you know like my other oh my god well that sounded horrible but i'm not gonna i'm not sugarcoating well you guys know that i'm not like i don't talk like that so um i'm just okay oh my god guys check out my other videos my video these oh my god that's so fucking annoying see that oh what the fuck just happened oh that was a deed cool so um yeah so thanks guys for watching uh, check out my video detail for my link to my video for my other social media like Instagram Facebook Twitter and um, Snapchat so take care guys.